So Fish and Game officials in New Hampshire want stricter punishments now for reckless hikers who don't pay search and rescue bills. State lawmakers are considering a bill which would suspend a hiker's driver's license if they refuse to pay. Every year, Fish and Game rescues about 200 people. Only those who are not properly prepared, about 10 to 12, are asked to repay the costs. And State Fish and Game Colonel Kevin Jordan says the number who don't pay is even smaller. When we end up with someone who we're, we are looking to suspend, it is someone that we either have heard absolutely nothing from, it is someone that has signed up and agreed to make small monthly payments and has not made one. It's, it's the extreme. So we're talking about three or four people per year, if that. And we should point out that Fish and Game never seeks repayment if hikers have a hunting, fishing, or recreational vehicle license, or if they have a so-called hike safe card. The $25 card acts as insurance, basically, against paying any cost for a rescue.